So what we're going to do is we're going to walk through how to take a look at your announcements from Canvas as a parent. What I've done for this one, we're going to do it on a computer. So I've not only logged into my email here, but on the next tab over, I've logged in as a parent on Canvas. So if I look at the announcements that come into my email, if I click here, it's going to open up the algebra announcement and I can read it and see it here. There are two things to note. Sometimes there are links that are embedded by the teacher. And sometimes if you look here at the very bottom, it says view announcement. If I click view announcement, it will open up in a new tab. The one thing you want to be aware of, if I'm not logged into Canvas as a parent, it's going to give me an error. So now that I've seen the announcement here, I can scroll through and take a look and remind my children that there are office hours today if they need. There is something that they need to do to check some polynomials and then um, what the homework is for Monday. And then what is going to be if they're in a Tuesday, Thursday class or a Wednesday, Friday class. What I want to do is show you a trick. So in your email, you may get a ton of emails, but there's a trick. If you search for this email address here, notifications at addinstructure.com, and you search your email for that, you're going to come up with just the announcements that have come from Canvas. As you get more and more emails into your account, you may miss one or two, but that's a good way to find them. There's always another way. If I go into Canvas, go to my dashboard, and any one of the courses here, you can go to the little speech um, megaphone, and you can click that. For example, let's go to the, the science course here and click. It will bring me directly to the announcements page, and then you look for the latest one, which is generally always at the top. I click on the um, title, that will bring me to the announcement. Now I can see really quickly what is due before, during, and after class. In another video, we're going to go over how to see announcements on a mobile device.